Hey y'all, what's up? It's everything track now. I'm in Florida, but I still gotta make this video for y'all. So the 2022 Commonwealth Games is going on, and the 200 meters for the women's finals has just ended a minute ago. And we just saw an incredible race from Favor Old Philly, the, one of the greatest 200 meter runners of 2022 in college, and Elaine Thompson Hera, one of the greatest women to ever do it in the history of track and field. Now, these both duked it out. These both really duked it out, and I have my prediction. I said Elaine Thompson Hera could win, but if she wins, it's going to be on the hair of her chinny chin chin. So what happened? Well, Favor Philly did not let her go. And when I say not let her go, she showed Elaine Thompson Hera just because I'm 19, that don't mean nothing. So Elaine Thompson Hera did come in first with a time of 2202, with Favor Philly coming in second with a time of 2251, and Obama coming in third with a time of 2280. So even though Favor Philly didn't win, she still was able to run with one of the greatest to ever do it and was able to prove herself that even her as a 19 year old, She's not scared of anybody. So she did get her back blown, unfortunately, but she still came in second. She got the prize money. It is what it is. She showed that even though she's 19, she can still do what she needs to do. Now, Elaine Thompson Hera, congratulations. Even though she ran against B class runners, congratulations. She still won. But hey, she's taking that money back home, she's taking the bag back home. She's representing Jamaica, and that's what it's all for, all right? So here's my question for the future. What do you think these two will do for 2023 and the next track season? And do you think Elaine Thompson and Harold will ever run indoors? I just want to know if you all think she'll run indoors. And if she does run, run indoors, how will she do? And for favor of Philly, do you think she's going to set a new standard at LSU, the college that she currently goes to? Or do you think this might be her last year at LSU and she might transfer to another college? We'll have to find out. But for now, they're doing their thanks. Shout out to both of them. And if you like the video, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Turn on post notification bell. We're on the road to 3K. And I'm going to see all y'all later, all right? Peace.